Good morning, Shafter High School, and welcome back to another great episode of HQTV, Shafter High School's news source. I'm Nevaeh Cruz. And I'm Natalie Overa. Today is March 2nd. Now let's take a look at what's going on in our general community. Students, don't forget to check the Lost and Found located at the Dean's Office if you are missing something. Tutoring is still open from Monday through Thursday from 3 to 7 p.m., so if you guys need help with anything, just stop by. Listos, there will be a quick meeting Thursday during lunch in room 410 with Mr. Maldonado at the last 15 minutes of lunch. Chess Club, you'll be meeting this Friday in room 604 during lunch. Sophomores and juniors, the deadline to apply for ROC or CTEC programs is Friday, March 11th. Their rep will be here at lunch outside the Dean's office on Monday, March 7th to answer any questions that you might have. Now let's send it over to weather with Sam. Hey guys, it's Sam, your meteorologist today. Um, I feel like I haven't seen you guys in forever. It's been, it's been a long time. Very long time. <laughs> Anyways, let's take a look at this week's weather forecast. So today is going to be a high of 78, which is really, 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 really hot for me. I don't know. It's, I've been used to the cold and that transition from being 50 degrees to 78. Oh not going to be well. Tomorrow is going to be a high of 75 and a low of 38. Friday is going to be a high of 62 and a low of 44. And Saturday is going to be a high of 52 and a low of 39. So there's a lot of fluctuating going on between the temperatures from it being 52 to 78. It's not, not good. Very not, very not good. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> let's send it back to the main show. Thank you, Sam, for updating us on the four-day forecast. Now, seniors, if you have not bought a senior shirt, they are being sold for only $5. You can buy it at the finance office or you can buy it at the pride store. This is the shirt. Very nice. Thank you to Isaac for being our model today. And the financial aid application deadline is today. If you guys have not submitted yours yet, go to the Career Center as soon as possible. You need to bring your social security number and your parents' 2020 tax info. The government or econ class has 100% financial aid completion by March 2nd, which is today's March 2nd. Today, I literally was getting to that, Isaac. God, give me a second. Today is March 2nd, and those of you who have the 100, oh my gosh, sorry guys, I cannot talk today. 100% financial aid completion by today, you will get a pizza party. So. Encourage your classmates to get that done today. Guys, that's literally free money for yes, college. Yes, take advantage of today. that. Those of you who are still interested in attending VC but haven't been able to attend a workshop, VC is offering a series of virtual application workshops today and on March 9th from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. So if you guys are wanting to go to VC, make sure to take advantage of those workshops. The March scholarships are now available along with many other scholarships, which we say all the time on HQTV. So if you are interested in wanting to get free money for college, go see Mrs. De La Cruz in the Career Center. If you are needing to get your transcript to a college, please allow three to five business days for transcripts to be processed. If you need an electronic official transcript, request them via parchment.com. Now, let's send it over to Eddie with sports. Hello and good morning, Shafter High. I'm Eddie Perez, and I, and I will be your sports anchor today. And uh, let's get into the updates. Yesterday, all the girls' softball teams played against Golden Valley, and they all won. Let's go! Woo! So Varsity won with a score of a whopping 19 to 2. They crushed them. JV won with a score of 13 to 12, and also, this was pretty crazy. So Frostoff was, for a while, it was like 11 to 3, but they made a comeback. They got, they ended the game with a 16 to 15 point thing, but that's awesome. That's a really, really awesome comeback. Congratulations, ladies. Uh, varsity B Baseball played against Golden Valley as well, and again, another whopping score. 18 to 2. Let's go. Nice. Great job, boys. That's what we like to see. Varsity softball will be playing at a tournament at BC. Um, the bus departs at 4 30. 
And that's about it. Now let's send it back to the main show. Thank you, Eddie, for telling us our sports for today. The Shafter Young Adults presents Newsies. The show dates are March 3rd through the 6th, which starts tomorrow, and March 11th and 13th. It will take place at the Shafter Ford Theater. So if you know where Tin Cup's at. It's right over there. Right over there. <laughs> Tin Cup. Tin Cup. There will be a discount on tickets for students, and all you need is your school ID, and you can buy your tickets for $8. Just a little PSA, the flyer we put up, you cannot scan that for students. You can't scan that. You have to go in person and buy your tickets at the Ford Theater. But make sure to take your school ID with you or else you won't get that discount. Are you going to go see the play? I'm going to be honest with you. We have a track meet. Oh, that's and right. We have practice every day. So that's right. So we'll try our best, but... I'm going to try to go because their plays are awesome. I highly recommend you guys go. They've done... I know they've done Wizard of Oz, Peter Pan, and they're all amazing. So it is worth it, guys. And Mr. Perucci's in this one. Yes, he is in it. So if you want to go see him, go out on those dates. For lunch today, we are having a orange chicken and brown rice bowl. Sounds mm. great. Yes. Amazing. amazing. Yeah, we'll... <laughs> on that note, generals, have a great day and tune in tomorrow for another great episode of HQTV. Shafter High School's news source.